And I actually think I keep making the shows with very similar themes. I think this show is about family. I think this show is about the boys who are the good guys in the show, and the superheroes are the bad guys. Um, the boys are the heroes because they stick together and they show each other loyalty and they've got each other's back and they're willing to admit vulnerability and weakness um, and they're scared and outmatched and outgunned but you know they're taking on these powerful forces not dissimilar from the way Sam and Dean would take on monsters and demons um, but I think this is but you know it's specific to this area and I think the thing I want to say, and I think that we all want to say in making this show, especially in today's day and age, like, um, what I love is the heroes of the show are the people that are, can express vulnerability and weakness and be imperfect, and the villains of the show are these sort of slick people who stand in front of the world and can refu refuse to admit any sort of weakness and, and somehow think that demonstrating a projected strength at all times is somehow good when what it is is dictatorial and autocratic and total bullshit. Um, and so the, the people who appear to be strong in the show are actually quite weak, and the people who are weak in the show are actually quite strong um, because we all need each other as people. And so there's a thematic to this show underneath the, I mean look, this show's really about superheroes are real. If they were real, they'd be dicks. Here's the team that fights them. <laughs> um, but, and, and you can watch the show and have a blast at that level, but we spend a lot of time building the iceberg under the water um, with, with the emotion and with the satire and with the thematics to make sure that there's a real deep uh, level, if that, if that the, a real deep level that people, that people want to explore. Eric, I just feel like you really eloquently described the uh, superheroes as a presidential. <laughs> <laughs>